How do butterflies fly? Well, butterflies can only fly when their body temperature is above 27 degrees. So when they're cool, they expose the underside of their wings to sunlight to heat themselves up. Now, butterflies fly via indirect flight, and that means that the muscles in their body that move their wings up and down are attached directly to their thorax and deform their thorax, as opposed to being attached directly to their wings. Now, how exactly do they move their wings up and down and fly? Well, they have two sets of muscles. On the, on the downward stroke, a set of dorsal longitudinal muscles compress the butterfly's thorax from back to front. Now, this causes the upper surface of their thorax, also known as a notum, to bow upwards, causing its wings to flip down. Now, on the upward stroke, another set of muscles, called the tergosternal muscles, pull the notum downwards, uh, causing the wings to flip upwards. Now, there is another stunning phenomena that gives butterflies their lift and flight, and that is by using vortexes. So, their sharp wings cut through the air, creating swirls of air above their wings, and that creates a low-pressure vortex above their wings. And this low-pressure vortex actually sucks the butterfly higher and even allows their wings to lift back up on the upstroke with even less resistance. Seeing these amazing formers and rock macaques up so close that are, again, endemic and specific to this area of Taiwan.